a Groupon challenge. We always get in trouble when we're at places. A bit nervous about this challenge. We get to sit at this table. Why did I come here? That would have been very stupid. This is freaky. <laughs> What's happening, free game? We are coming to you live. But not live. From our home in London, where Katie is bouncing around like a crazy happy person because we've got a very fun challenge today. Before we get into that though, guys, let us know where you guys are coming live or not live from. Where are you in the world? What's happening? Is everything good? I hope so. Let us know in the comments below. There's a lot of O oh rhyming there, wasn't there? Yes, yeah, so, like Bob said, we've got very exciting, but I'm a bit nervous about this challenge. Is There's this... uncertainty at hand. Yeah, so we've got a lot planned today. We're going to be doing so much stuff in one day. We are doing a Groupon challenge for 24 hours. So everything we do for the next 24 hours has to be bought on Groupon. Now, for those of you that may or may not know Groupon, it's basically like a voucher site where you can get experiences, meals out, all sorts of things at a discounted price. But you can get anything from a facial or a massage to a parachute jump. They do all kinds of experiences, even restaurant vouchers, and it's all at discounted prices. There's lots of very, very random things on Groupon as well. Yeah. But you might buy something on there and it seems random, but then you go and you have a good time. Or the other way around. It yeah. looks great and you get there and it's not yeah. great. Yeah, you're like, I'm here for my one hour massage. And then it's like the most dankest place you've ever been into and you're thinking, why did I come here? But anyway. We're not doing any massages today, that's for sure. <laughs> Not now. Anyway, we are on a time. We have got to get out the door because we do have one lined up to start the day. Let's go and get Jojo and head out the door. We're just at the tube station now, guys, as we're heading into the centre of London. Just wanted to share with you as well something that we found really handy when we've been having journeys out in the car, on the tube, anywhere really, is a nice show that we've been listening to called BB and Tina, which you guys may remember we mentioned in a previous video, but we've been really enjoying their episodes. It's been really good for Jojo as well, because it's something on the go which he can zone out, listen to. He's listening to the latest episode now, which is one he's already listened to the other day, but he's enjoying it so much he's listening again. And he's listening to their radio play, basically what a radio play is. It's better than an audio book, because it has not just obviously the audio of the story, but it has a narration, it has sound effects, so it really opens your mind and it really opens your imagination which is perfect for him because while you're on journeys and stuff like that and it might be a bit boring it's helping all of your creativity spark in your mind but what's been your favorite part of this episode um when bb used like the magic spell to like find the horses that little part yeah, yeah. she actually uses magic quite a bit and it's I one know. of the characters bb's a witch and like a good witch and she uses magic to solve problems because they like a lot of problem solving they care about animals they're always on different adventures and sometimes sometimes getting into a bit of trouble as well but yeah i really liked in this episode they have really good messages in there and i think it's really good for kids to receive these messages on this one there seems to be a big focus on promises and keeping promises and how important that is mm -hmm. yeah i'll give you a little clip now to listen to guys just so you can get a taste of what they're all about father expects you to sit around by yourself even though you'd already promised to come to the party yeah afraid so but a promise is a promise well what can i do we need to go see your father and talk to about it. What? Good idea, Tina. Let's do it. Come on, Amadeus. You too, Sabrina. Yeah. Hold on. Hey, wait for me. Hurry, Maharaja. Yeah. BB and Tina are right. A promise is a promise. Yeah, that's a really enjoyable episode, that one as well, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. It kind of went all different ways, didn't it? Like, yeah. it like you think they're going to be in trouble and then they get out of it, another thing happens, they get out of yeah. it. It's like life really, isn't it? Yeah. They have a YouTube channel as well, guys, but I'll put a link in the description for their radio play so you can check out all of the great episodes they have online. Okay, guys, quick tube journey and we are in Westfield Shopping Centre. However, that's nothing to do with the Groupon. We're literally walking through, which is quite difficult for this one because she's trying to do everything. <laughs> yeah. 
so. She's trying to get the full Westfield experience. No, but we're not here for that. No. We just walk on our way through because the first thing we're going to is just the other side of here. So the first thing, guys, we are going to, which we bought a voucher from Groupon, is an upside down house. I'm not really sure what's in this upside down house. I think I can oh, make it. Oh, oh my, my goodness, God. yeah. This is what we're talking about. This is the randomness of a Groupon voucher. There is the upside down house. It says we are open, thank goodness. That's a good sign, yeah. But the next question is, does the voucher code work? Because you what know, do you mean? well, there's always terms and conditions. You get there and no, then they're like, no, it's only for a Sunday or something. But okay, let's go. It's let's... not a Sunday today. No. Whoa, look at this, Jojo. Now, how do we get in there? No, I don't know. Oh, this is the way in. Another good sign. Yeah, we are open. Okay. You got the voucher on your phone, Bob? I was on the wrong app, I was on Trippy Points. I'm trying to log in. Oh my goodness. That's a good start. Thank you. Okay, it worked. Can you go? I've never had that as a warning. What? But you might feel dizzy at first. <gasps> oh, and I, I feel dizzy. I see me. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, the, the, the floor's like going sideways. That doesn't work. <laughs> oh, this is free kick. This is really. <laughs> Jojo, <laughs> <That's right. laughs> this is freaky. This is really freaky. Oh, look up. <laughs> the idea is that you can take like Instagram photos and then you flip them round and people can't figure out how you're doing the things you're doing. Right, okay. Help. She gave me some advice, said you need to get floor and ceiling involved. Floor and ceiling. Yeah, so you, should we go round and try and get some pictures together? Yeah, okay. I've got one, I've got one, here we go. Okay, go on. So you've got to get the floor in and the ceiling. And he's doing a handstand. Oh, you're doing a handstand on a chair. That's amazing. How did you do that? Wow. You were just here the whole time. Right, let's have some fun. Come on. Come on in. I know, this is freaky. We're walking like uphill and downhill at different places where you should not be walking uphill and downhill. It's but it's so fun. much fun. This is so much fun. So that is group one task activity number one done. We're now going to head on to number two, which is only about a 15 minute walk down the road. And but I'm actually impressed with this. This has been a lot of fun. Yeah. I am feeling a little bit sick though, so let's get out. Okay, we are here at the next thing on our list, which you bought tickets for from Groupon. You can we see our home show behind us, which probably tells you a bit. Yeah, it's so it's the Ideal Home Exhibition. <laughs> but last time we came here was nine years ago when I bought my Vitamix on Mother's Day. Oh yeah, oh, it's by Mother's Day now. There you yeah. go. Do you want another Vitamix? No, I'm, my, no, I'm my, not carrying it. My one's still going strong. It so, is, yeah. Yeah, I'm happy about that. So yeah, um, this is how random it goes from an upside down house to an exhibition show. So we're gonna go in there, don't know about you, but I need the toilet first and then some food. Let's see if the voucher code works. It worked. And that was only 17 pounds for all of us as well. So for those of you who don't know what the Ideal Home Show is all about, it's an exhibition showing all different home ideas, furniture, uh, layouts, you name it, loads of different stuff. Even big hot tubs like this. Yeah, we're, we're, we're not going to do it justice by telling you about it though, because it's just like the stuff they have here is like stuff that you've never thought of or never seen before. I think it's still going on into it's, April, so yeah, it's like for two weeks it's or so. Absolutely. Look, we've got a swimming pool here. If we had a big house, I would buy one of these. And in you get. It's very deep as well, isn't it? And you can swim in it. It's deep, yeah. Yeah, I think it pushes the water so you can keep swimming. They've got all kinds of things hot tubs. I love this garden furniture as well. Like actual room that you can have in your garden. 
It's a good way to manifest things yeah. in your life that Should you we want. Go and find a food court or something like that. Yeah. They have a food court, hot food. Yeah, I'm sure they do. Look, this place is massive. There's all stalls up there as well. Amazing. Oh, I mean, they've even got cars here. Let's get a car. Look at this one. That is amazing. Wow. A proper country. Wow. You could have a full on party in there. That's Martin Lewis on stage over there. He's like the money guy, tells everyone how to save money. I'm the money guy. Oh, no, you're not. He is. I've noticed there's another festival in the same building that's on Groupon. Do we get. Is it including our ticket? I don't know. If not, we could just get a group on and go there. Oh, what's it called? Eat and Drink Festival. Yeah, my kind of festival. So we just spoke to a, a staff member here, and apparently this Eat Drink Festival is included as well. So we've just got two for one, basically. And we have to eat and drink. We have to get the full Eat Drink Festival experience. Of course, we? of course. We may have found something. We saw jacket potatoes, which is always a good sign. They've got all different food here, they've got their own food court. Do you know what? I almost bought a separate Groupon voucher for this festival. That would have been embarrassing, wouldn't it? Ooh. By two uh, when you get it included already. Yeah, that would have been very stupid. Jojo, I've just spotted at the burger place that says cheeky vegan, spicy <laughs> vegan. Oi, not you! I'm trying to do a sneaky thing with Jojo. This has got me written all over it. That's you. Yeah. You're a cheeky vegan. So what we got here? Two cheeky vegan burgers and chips. That's is that good? Look, well. He's gone straight you in. You can't wait, can you? And I got a jacket potato with vegan cheese and beans on there as well. Very good. Thank you. This is my kind of stall. Yeah, yeah, so that does slide down if you look under the cross, just like that. We've got a sink here, we've got some room up here. Yeah. Extractor here, we've got some cupboards. Look at that one. Oh, I like that. Oh, nice. Microwave up there, we've got some storage room. We've got a toilet that swivels around as well. when we're at places. He just said to Jojo, I'm going to put you in there. Oh no, 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 <laughs> please, please, guys. It does look like fun though, doesn't it? Put you in there. <laughs> Wait, should we just get that big one out and just throw it and then just walk off? And then everyone will just bat it around the place. Yeah, yeah, it'll be like no, a no, thing no. Going the No, 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 they're looking day. at us, they're looking at us. Can we just go? Can we go? Can we go? Okay, the ideal home show has been crossed off the group on list for today. So we're now heading on to our next one, which is the Shrek. Shrek Adventure? Shrek Adventure and it's in Westminster. Jojo's really excited about this, aren't you Jojo? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> We've had a lot of walking in the rain. Okay, we're here at Westminster. We've got the River Thames here, London Eye, Big Ben. Me. So the Shrek Adventure is the other side of the river over there. This was, I think, £24 on there per person they actually had a lot of these uh riverboat cruises on the groupon as well but we just didn't fancy it in this weather no. it, what, nothing was it worked fine did it yeah she, she said she put the times on next time i said i did look <laughs> that's not donkey no that's not that's not Shrek stuff. Yeah. 
photo opportunity. Now everybody, if you can just squeeze all the way down for me, that's it, using all the space down this end for me. Say hello. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of fun, wasn't it? That was amazing. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> we went years and years ago in a video when Jojo was four, but it wasn't as good as that. No, it was so much more, wasn't it? Yeah, and we were in. It lasts about like forty-five minutes or something. Yeah. yeah. So like, I, I recommend that. You had a good time, didn't you, Jojo? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well worth it. And it looks like a completely different day outside. Let's go and check it out. Look at this, it was raining when we went in there and now look at this. We would have filmed more in there, but just as we went in, the guy was just like, no cameras, turn your phones off. How dare they? Anyway, we're on to the next Groupon now, which is the Florence Nightingale Museum. And this costs £10.80 on Groupon. For all of us? Yeah. Oh, and it's only across the road as well. Nice and handy, let's go. So we're struggling to find this place, even though no, it, was, we're not. <laughs> it was supposed to be across the road. That looks nice though. I forgot to tell you guys something um, that happened in the Shrek adventure <laughs> to Bob. <laughs> no, what we happened? don't need to talk about that. Yeah, we need to talk about what happened, Jojo. No. He had to dance. The actors, there's, oh, there's lots of actors in there and they made him dance in front of everyone. <laughs> Look at you're just one of those people that always get picked on I've with got one things. of those faces, haven't I? Like, yeah, he looks like he'll be a laugh. Okay, we're here at the Florence Nightingale Museum. Let's see if the voucher code works. So Florence Nightingale was the first nurse. Well, she kind of, in a way, shaped how nursing is now. And I think she was quite revolutionary in the way that she chose to care for soldiers and help preserve life. What does it say in there? In June 1940, the Penny Black was the world's first postage stamp. Oh. Ooh. Okay, we're here at our next Groupon deal, guys. This one was £8.80. Yeah, and it's an old photograph opportunity. The sun's just gone right in my eyes. Ah! It's an old photograph, so they'll dress us up in old clothes, like olden day, like Victorian clothes or something like that, and then take a picture of us, and we get to keep the picture. But something tells me they're not going to allow us to film in there because obviously it's their business of selling the photograph. Yeah. So, yeah, but let's go anyway. So we're all done in there, guys. That was so much fun. I know. And like, the photos, we show the photos now. So lovely we actually got two in the end so yeah because we really like the one of Jojo on his own and I tell you what the people in there were so nice if you want to do something like that I thoroughly recommend checking them out they're called Cool Britannia Studios and they're around the West London by Victoria really nice place really nice people really it's, easy and fun experience it was such I that, that I swear that was my favorite thing of the day so far definitely me as well yeah so this day we've done well so far we've got a lot we've got a lot I in haven't know. we and also, when we came out of there, I, I must confess, I just went into the poshest restaurant ever. She got some bonus thing what's not on the Groupon list. Yeah, I, I went into this um, restaurant to basically ask to go to the toilet because I didn't know where there was a toilet. I got there and then there was a butler and I thought, oh my goodness, like, <laughs> what know the guys that are on the door? What they Wipe called? your bottom, ma'am. Dorman. Oh, dormant. Oh, there was yeah, there was a dormant on the door, all dressed in this beautiful red costume and everything. And he opened the door for me, and I just went in. And then I went to reception, and I said, "Excuse me, can I use the ladies, please?" Ah, who are you, who are you kidding, love? And they were like, "Okay, here we go." And then I had to walk through this thing, and they were all having afternoon tea. Where should go there? 
Let me check out if they do a Groupon for that place. No, no, no. They do, no, they do do afternoon teas on Groupon. But then anyway, I went into the toilet and they everything was gold and marble. You didn't have a hand dryer. You had to dry your hands on towels and then put them in the bin. Like towels, like proper towels. Look at you getting the full toilet experience. You should have gone in there then. I might now. It was just funny that I ended up having putting on a posh accent. Is it, isn't it funny? Imagine if there was a Groupon voucher for just using the toilet. Like toilet experience, 50 quid. I would do that. I you like, would. I like you nice just got toilets. it for free. You don't need to. But no, they do do afternoon teas on um, Groupon. I did see some afternoon teas. A cup of afternoon tea. Nah, we're not doing that. Anyway, our next one on the list, and this is our last one, it's food. Good yeah. food stuff. And we got, we spent, I think, £24 on this voucher yep. for all of us, and we get £60 worth of food in this restaurant. And it, I mean, it looks like a nice restaurant but we'll see when we get there. Okay, we're nearly at our final Groupon deal of the day. And food. Food, I was wondering. This is this is so welcome as well. Yeah. So hungry, we so worked hard. So we've got 60 pounds worth of food to spend and I'm wondering if we'll stay in the budget because of how hungry we are. Yeah, if we go over, it's fine. I would say this is a great tip of the day. Crazy tip of the day. If you want to have a fun day out in London, Go on Groupon, man. Yeah. There, as well, there's just there's an abundance of things, and especially food deals as well. Yeah, there's so many food deals, so many restaurant deals. If if you don't want afternoon tea, do a restaurant. So I am very much looking forward to this. It better be good. Okay. Oh, this is a nice restaurant. Well, it looks nice anyway. We get to sit at this table. That's pretty cool. They do they do vegan pizza. That's good. So we're sat here at this motorbike Vespa, and we've just got our starters here. Check this out. I've got this banging bruschetta. Some chips on the table. Katie's got chips. That's a good amount of chips as well. Very yeah. good. I was thinking of having mine with my main as well, though. You can save some then. Yeah. And Jojo, what you got? Garlic bread. Garlic bread. Yeah. We've been talking about what Jojo does when he reviews food. What do you do? It's pretty good. <laughs> he always says it. It's always, it's pretty good. Ketchup's going on. We're living a group on dream. Look at what this woman's doing. She's stealing Jojo's garlic bread. My tomatoes. Now what are you doing? about sharing. Sharing is caring, okay? Chips going on top. I just wanted to try it. You've left your chips and just been eyeing up our food the whole time. Yeah. You're terrible. You like having a dog at the table. Yeah. Some greens are going on there now as well. This is a combo, look at that. How's yours, Bob? Alright. It's pretty good? Uh, three, that's pretty good. <laughs> so you got you need a knife. You need a knife. Two knives, good. Oh, Jojo, so you both got the veggie ones. Yeah, and you've got... Arabiata. We've got some chips left. Yeah, you ate your chips, you're coming off the mine. No, he, he took most of mine. <laughs> you took my garlic bread. So you took most of my chips. Time for the pasta test. Mm. What do you pretty, say, mummy? Pretty good. Yeah, she doesn't say as well as you, though. Yeah, we can mix it up. We can chuck some chips in there as well. You feeling that? Chips on pasta? He's totally copying me. I taught him how to do this. Taught me. Tip of the tip of the day, guys. Put chips in pizzas. I remember where you taught, taught me as well. Where were we? CGI for, no, Frankie and Benny. No, this California style pizza or whatever it was, and this is what you did about that. Yeah. I remember that day like it was yesterday, love. Try and put chips in pizzas, guys. It'll change your life. Apparently I've just been told by Katie that I did the pizza and chips combo wrong. You did it that way, put the chips in that way, but this is how I taught you. I taught you to go like that and then put ketchup on top. Do it like that. Maybe I took your teachings and just went next level and did it better. This is coming from the woman that decided to put chocolate sauce inside a Yorkshire pudding and it didn't work out. She doesn't always get it right. That was one good meal, wasn't it? Yeah, it was cold. La, La Piola. I don't know if you can see it because of the lighting right now. It's an Italian restaurant. It's very delicious. In I'm south tired. west London. Can we go home? Yes, come on. Okay.
Back home now, guys, after what a fun day. This has been one of the best days ever. That was the best. I said that to you when we were in the restaurant. I've had the best day ever. It's been quite a challenge, but one thing you guys might be interested to know is how much money we have saved in doing everything via Groupons all day. And I can tell you, from not spending the full price and using the Groupon price, the amount of money that we saved is 151 pounds and 55 pence. Jojo's quite surprised at that. He's got his jammies on already, as you can see. <laughs> yeah, we're getting ready to settle down for the evening. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this. Katie can't stop staring at the picture no, of Jojo. Oh, you're so cute! No. It is cool, yeah. Yeah. It's pretty good. I would highly recommend that place. In fact, there's a lot of places today that I would recommend. Yeah. Pretty much all of them. Yeah. But that's where we're going to end this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate every single one of you. And we will see you all in the next video. Just remember, though, no matter where you guys are in the world, you guys always stay free. And just keep rising.